The Department of Space organized a webinar on unlocking India's potential in the space sector on Thursday. Chairman K. Shivan said that ISRO is not being privatized. He also said that the government's decision to ban the import of communication satellites has offered a huge opportunity for private players. Speaking at the webinar, ISRO Chairman K. Shivan said, Space reforms were not aimed at privatizing ISRO. He added that the space agency will look at research and development, capacity building, while facilitating participation of the private sector. Again, again, I'm repeating, it is not the privatization of ISRO. In fact, the whole mechanism, the whole aim of the system is enabling the private people to carry out the space activity, which otherwise being done by ISRO. It is not privatization of ISRO. And in fact, that the activities of ISRO are going to increase with the time and ISRO will be able to better utilize its resources in taking up the developmental as well as capacity building activities of the government of India rather than the routine production activities. The ISRO chairman called the ban on import of communication satellites a huge opportunity for private players. Representing the industry at the webinar, Anand Mahindra, chairman of the Mahindra Group, said the public-private partnership model is the way to go while unlocking potential in the space sector. Think of creating structures and systems that have never existed before. Think differently about achieving the goal, whether you're a public or a private player. Think of what support you might require from the law, from financial institutions, from regulators, from academia to make these structures work. Think of what incentives and rights need to be given and how they are to be protected. And let's make it part of our work to think about how to produce the next generation of problem solvers like Narasimha. Let's think beyond existing paradigms, and I think the answers will emerge. Dr. R. Uma Maheshwaran, Scientific Secretary at ISRO said, the Space Activities Bill has been submitted to the Prime Minister's office and the Cabinet will take a decision on it after inter-ministerial consultations. Eminent personalities from industry and academia attended the webinar. This is Aruna Thakur's report for Rajasabha TV.